Morning, guys. April 27th, 22nd, I'm sorry, 2024. Months going by fast enough already. So, uh, got the cab lights working and completed. Everything's wired up, taped up, sealed up. No problem. Gonna work now, fine. So, I'm moving on to the headliner. So, I went online, looked up a headliner for this truck, priced it out. To have two pieces of cardboard shipped here would be $66. Little Lucky's got sleepy this morning laying in the sun. She takes, she has her, she has like running around going crazy. Then all of a sudden, wham, she just lays down and takes a nap. And then for a couple hours, she'll be lazy. Then she'll get up and start running around all crazy again. She was like doing laps out here yesterday chasing a squirrel. Up in the tree like she's going to catch it, you know. So I had plenty of the uh, aluminum coil. Brown white aluminum coil. It's actually, I think, the bronze or something like that. But I cut me a piece of aluminum. This is what I cut off, obviously. You can see it's kind of shaped like a V, which would be towards the front of the windshield. And I brought it in and started screwing it in place. Little 48's doing good. I've been driving it quite a bit now. I went over and I put uh, 10 gallons of gas in. I noticed that the gas gauge is kind of funny on it. And I don't think it's a sending unit. The gas gauge itself was a gas gauge for a boat that I had. Like a big, you know, outboard, inboard, outboard type boat. And uh, for some reason it reads backwards. When it's empty, it's full, and when it's full, it's empty, which I can live with, but it's kind of weird. So I got a white plastic, I mean, white uh, aluminum coil installed. I had a mark along here. I still got a cut off over here, but you can see it's starting to come together pretty good. Uh, it's going to be all screwed in along the front, and then the along the back. I'm using the self-tapper screws to install it and then uh, I'll paint that and it'll be good to go. Haven't done much on these yet. I pretty much got them filed down the lead so that it fits in. I haven't touched this since a uh, couple of weeks because I'm not working on the van truck right now obviously. I'm getting some of the uh, finishing details on the golf truck. I don't know why I was so, just wanted to have those cab lights working. I love the look of that at night when you're going down the road, you know. See what's going on here in Rusty Rhode Island, guys. Monday morning, I'm at it. I'm going to get this headliner finished up. I wish I could do the time lapse, but uh, I don't, I'd have to do a separate video because I don't know how to blend the videos. I don't know how to mix the videos. I don't have the tools to do that. I just shoot it on my laptop and hit download and boom, you know. <clears throat> Out from Rusty Rhode Island. Hope you're enjoying your Monday. <laughs> 